see. You do your special gloves when we get to that part. This is what we're going to fill the balloon up with. Make sure you take the cap off. This is iodine. We're going to clean this. I'm going to drink some water. This is an empty little thing, or you can use the full one, but just squirt out the junk that's in it. That because I found over, I think some like this that are full, but then are not in the kit. Okay. It's just for that. It's just to pull the water out of the balloon. And I clean these with alcohol, just because I'm going to touch them. Right. Okay, I know what to touch them. Like this aren't really sanitary, sanitary. And then this is the silver colored casket. It's in another plastic container. Okay, so that's my tea bag. Maybe use the cap from this tea bag to put on that light bag. Maybe. Yeah, over here. We'll see how it goes. Alright, first thing you do is your normal stuff. Clean around here like you do every morning. Very thing you And you want to notice if this is getting stinky, then it's got a problem going on. Right. It's red. Yeah, it, it was red yesterday. <laughs> Don't throw my stuff off the bed now. I'm making mad at you. So when it's red like that, you want to make sure you use that pink stuff. Yeah, I put it on the other day. He wants me to. Yeah. Anyway, when I go to do it myself, I'll I should be able to just watch the video. The first time. Yeah, you should. But still. Okay. Well, you already know how to do this. Yeah. when the gauze gets icky that you put even if you've done it just put a clean piece of gauze on there you know sometimes when he because he gets jerked around so much yeah that it, it makes it more i think it makes it more goopier and i think the wetness is what causes that that's what i'm assuming i don't know don't pick up that knee <laughs> no kicking have stuff on your legs. Alright. How full of that pee bag? It's pretty full. I better go get the bucket. I think I'm going to 